This video covers the steps to configure the backwards compatibility between the Tsunami MP XBT100 series and the Tsunami MP8200 and 800 series. A uh, couple of quick notes. The Tsunami MP XP1000 uh, not backwards compatible with the Tsunami 8100 series. And the firmware on the 10100 uh, radios must be at firmware version 6.3.x. Uh, if you have any other previous version, it will not work. All right, so um, we're going to go ahead and discuss how we can connect um, the MP8200 and MP800 um, series with the uh, MP slash XB10100 series radios. Okay, now the process itself is uh, is fairly simple. Uh, it goes down to um, configuring uh, any of uh, the proxim radios uh, MP uh, base station to talk to a subscriber or a quick bridge to talk to another quick bridge okay the process is the same so um, what we're going to do is we're going to start with uh, uh, on the uh, MP side the 10100 side okay so this is our base station all right so what we're going to do is under warp config we're going to go in operation mode we're going to go ahead and make sure that we have HT or high throughput Okay, um, this is uh, going to be the only way that uh, they're going to be able to communicate. All right, legacy is for our uh, uh, 5054 radios, and then uh, very high throughput or VHT. That is when you have a um, uh, 10100 talking to another 10100. Okay, those are the high speeds. Right, so we are in high throughput. Okay, um, so we have. Uh, channel bandwidth is going to be the 20 or 40 okay make sure that we have the channel uh, frequency channel selected and then of course the network name okay uh, and then if you use an encryption uh, we have to make sure that the encryption is the same so on the 800 side okay uh, we have an su we have the channel bandwidth okay and we have our network name okay uh, and then once again if we are using uh, if we're using security, the security has to be the same, okay? The ne uh, the network security, okay, the key. Okay, if we go here, on here, we click edit. Okay, we have the network secret. Make sure that the network secret is uh, correct as well. Click advanced, okay, and it's, um, and it's right there, okay? So uh, that is basically it. We just got to make sure that um, on the MPXB 10100, uh, under warp we have HT right we have the network name and then uh, we have if you have uh, encryption enable right? we have to make sure that uh, that has to match between the two right and under advanced we have the network secret and basically the same thing on the 8200 800 series all right we have of course um, we have to be in the same frequency domain all right uh, same uh, this is the SU. We have our channel bandwidth. Make sure the network name is the same. Uh, make sure that we have the same uh, network secret. And when you use an encryption, make sure the encryption is the same. Uh, that is how we connect a uh, MP XP10100 to the uh, MP8200 uh, slash uh, 800 series. To learn more about Proxim Wireless and our solutions, please visit us at Proxim.com or follow us at Twitter at Proxim.